Right now at 6, a request to remove another local Confederate monument. A Friday evening protest to take down another symbol of history underway as we speak. Now, good evening. We hope that you're doing well right now. A protest is underway demanding the removal of Johnny Rebel. That statue is located at the Old Warwick Courthouse. It's been covered up for several weeks following protests at other monuments. But people at the demonstration say the monument needs to be removed. And on your side's Brett Hall, live at the protest. Brett, what's going on now? Well, actually, it just concluded, Tom and Anita. About 60 people gathered here for the last hour to, again, call for the removal of this monument that has sat here at the historic Warwick Courthouse pro uh, complex for 111 years. Again, as you mentioned, covered up now for the last several weeks. But they are hoping that their voices can relocate this from public grounds. It was earlier this week that city council reached a consensus that this should be moved. Now, it's not as simple, though, as what the process Portsmouth and Norfolk have to go through because this sits on a historic easement, meaning the state first has to sign off on any removal or relocation, and then the lengthy 60-day process that has been set up by the state would begin here in Newport News. So Councilman Dave Jenkins just told the crowd it's likely not until October that any action will be done, but he as well as Councilman uh, Marcellus, he's, they said that they just need to keep the pressure on and hopefully there will be a change. They say this is not a memorial to honor Confederate veterans. They say going back into history, it was placed here by a Confederate sympathizer who was mayor during the first decade of the 1900s. So they say it serves no purpose to honor those who gave their lives in any conflict. It is just a symbol of oppression, and that is why it needs to go. We'll have more coming up tonight on Wavy News 10 at 11. Live in Newport News, Brett Hall, 10 on your side.